And sticking with news of the typhoon, one of the hardest hit areas is the Ulithi Atoll, which took a direct hit as the eye passed over the islands on Tuesday night. A Hawaii man originally from Ulithi will be leaving soon to help. These pictures taken just yesterday by the Pacific Maritime Association show the damage caused by 160 mile per hour winds hitting the Ulithi Atoll. Max Yarawamai is originally from Ulithi, and while they've weathered storms there before, he was shocked to see the damage. We got all these pictures from, from Ulithi, and it's really um, roofs and, you know, the high school on Falalap, all the roofs are gone. Uh, church um, on Falala, uh, the ocean came up. There's a little lodge on the island. Uh, the ocean came right up and tore the, the roof off. So it's a lot of uh, damage uh, with houses and trees, uh, coconut trees breaking in half. That's the high school there. It serves the students from all the neighboring islands. Classes are now canceled as the 1,000 or so residents of the atoll are in survival mode, desperately in need of food, water, and shelter. Initial reports say their food crops were destroyed by the storm surge. From what I understand is that the storm surge came up to about 15 feet, and a lot of the islands are only like 12 to 15 feet high. So when this kind of storm comes in, the islands turn into like three islands or so because the water goes right over it. Yarrow Amai leaves tomorrow, headed for Guam, where he'll buy supplies, then fly to Yab. He hopes to arrive in the Ulithi Atoll later next week via fishing boat. So now I want to go down and see it firsthand on what really is needed because right now it's going to, we're going to be on like a first respond, you know, quick fix. But what's what down the road? I want to really see what can we do. Now, one building that's standing is the health clinic that Max helped build through the nonprofit Oceania Community Health. If you'd like to make a donation to help the people of Ulithi, just go to the As Seen On section of KITV.com. Incredible to see all of those neighborhoods just wiped out. Wow. Yeah.